Welcome to Key Tech. Please describe this channel if you are interested in today's video. The reason why the lithography machine is very important is mainly because the lithography process accounts for about one third of the entire chip manufacturing cost and takes about one half of the entire chip manufacturing time. Therefore, the lithography machine is an essential equipment for chip manufacturing. Lithography machines, known as the jewel and the crown of the semiconductor industry, are inseparable from this core equipment for making high-end chips. The working principle of the photolithography machine is like the printing of an old-fashioned film camera. The laser passes through the mask and prints the circuit diagram on the wafer. The mask is similar to film and the wafer is similar to photo paper. In this process, the wavelength of the laser is the most critical link which determines the process of the lithography machine. Using deep ultraviolet, that is, DUV, can reach the limit of 7 nanometers, but generally, the chip process produced by DUV will not be smaller than 10 nanometers. The use of extreme ultraviolet, that is, EUV light source, can shrink the manufacturing process to below 7 nanometers, or even smaller. At present, more EUV lithography machines are used in the manufacture of high-end chips. At present, the leader in the global lithography machine manufacturing industry is AMSL in the Netherlands. They have an absolute advantage in high-end lithography machines. They are currently the only company in the world that can produce EUV lithography machines. Of course, good products are not cheap, and EUV lithography machines are expensive. SMIC once spent more than 100 million US dollars to purchase such a lithography machine. Recently, the United States, together with Japan and the Netherlands, wants to further restrict imports from Chinese companies, preventing ASML from selling EUV lithography machines to China, and even restricting the manufacturing process of DUV lithography machines sold to China. However, it is impossible for China to stop its own semiconductor manufacturing industry because of this, but to bypass their restrictions from several aspects and develop its own chip industry. China achieved a breakthrough in the research and development of laser light sources. At present, the lithography machines that China can independently produce are still in the 90 nanometers process and there is still a big gap between the advanced lithography machines below 28 nanometers. However, China has been catching up in various technical details. Recently, Harbin University of Science and Technology announced an important breakthrough in the laser field, including EUV light source technology, which undoubtedly provides a guarantee for the future development of domestic EUV lithography machines. Coupled with previous advances in workbenches and objective lenses, China's self-produced DUV and even EUV lithography machines are likely to be realized within a few years. China continues to develop DUV lithography machines. No matter what kind of lithography machine, the purpose is to produce chips. In addition to EUV lithography machines, China has not given up on the research and development of DUV lithography machines. Because there are many kinds of chips themselves, not all chips need high-end lithography machines to manufacture, a mobile phone may have only one chip that can use EUV, and automobiles and other equipment need to be equipped with more ordinary chips, which still require DUV photolithography. Engraving machine In addition, DUV lithography machines still have a certain potential in shortening the process. For example, the self-alignment dual imaging technology adopted by SMIC, referred to as SAQP technology, can realize 7 nanometers related processes on DUV lithography machines and even achieve 5 nanometers and 3 nanometers. Since Chinese chip manufacturing does not necessarily rely on EUV lithography machines, it naturally does not need to rely on foreign EUV lithography machines. In addition, whether it is to use domestic DUV lithography machines to replace imported goods or to use DUV lithography machines to manufacture chips, costs can be reduced. In this way, the pressure came to asthma side. 
In fact, they are well aware that the laws of physics are equally applicable in China, and China will be able to build its own EUV lithography machine sooner or later, but they did not expect China to move so fast. China has already lost a lot of orders through its own research and development of lithography machines and the import of equipment from other countries. Starting from the second half of 2022, they finally couldn't bear it anymore and were willing to continue selling lithography machines to China. In fact, the production of lithography machines by ASML requires the cooperation of dozens of countries to jointly produce parts. Dozens of trucks are needed just to transport the parts and the objective lens needs several months of polishing. Including labor costs, the total cost exceeds 100 million US dollars. In contrast, China has a complete industrial chain and more advantages in investment and human resources. Once China can realize mass production of lithography machines, it can be said that the hard days of ASML are still to come. China delivered the first domestic packaging lithography machine. Not long ago, there was another good news that Shanghai Microelectronics Packaging and Testing Lithography Machine, SMEE, was officially delivered. Packaging and testing is also a process of chip production, the purpose is to test the chip and improve the yield rate. Although compared with the EUV lithography machine mentioned earlier, the technical content is much less, but after all, the words domestic and lithography machine are really connected together. After the chip is produced, the wafer on which it is located needs to be cut to remove the useless metal. Just like after a piece of furniture is finished, there is polishing and polishing. The equipment required for this step is called an etching machine. There is a difference between an etching machine and a lithography machine, but there is an essential difference. The production of high-end chips requires both high-end lithography machines and high-end etching machines, both of which are indispensable. Compared with the difficult situation of lithography machines, China has reached an advanced level in the manufacture of etching machines. Not long ago, TSMC accepted the 5 nanometers etching machine produced by SMIC, and the two parties reached a cooperation on this. In addition to being assembled on the 5 nanometers production line, China Micro's etching machine is still moving towards 3 nanometers. Etching machines are not as technically difficult as lithography machines, and the price is much lower. Each machine is between hundreds of thousands to several million dollars, not hundreds of millions of dollars like a lithography machine. Some countries restrict China's import of EUV lithography machines. In addition to its own research and development, China is also making continuous progress in DUV lithography machines, packaging and testing lithography machines, and etching machines. Although these technologies are not as hardcore as high-end lithography machines, they are by no means tasteless. Together, they support the survival and progress of the domestic semiconductor industry. Maybe the import of DUV lithography machines will be completely restricted in the future, and China can only prevent problems before they happen and continue to carry out independent technology research and development.